All right, so um, there's plenty of people that will tell you you can buy a, a, a or make your own snorkel kit for a whole lot cheaper than the kits, which yes, you can, and Corey is absolutely able to do that. I bought this kit so that what protrudes out looks super cool um, because I'm kind of against this whole snorkel idea anyways. Um, so, but what you do get with the kit is you get pre-planned uh, angles. If you go plumb this by yourself and just go to Home Depot or whatever, you're going to grab some 45s, you're going to grab some 90s, you're going to do whatever. Um, and hope for the best and probably run back to Home Depot or Lowe's one or two times to get another fitting or do whatever. This already comes pre-planned and if you actually read the instructions, they even the hoses are marked. You probably, I don't know if you can see here or whatever, um, but they're marked. This is a 36 hose, so we know that this length of hose goes to this adapter and this 45 to this goes from here to there expediting a lot of this mission um, this is your CVT um, intake which uh, actually went like kind of that okay and so all that comes comes out and you don't use this piece anymore and so this is the PVC pipe going into that connection and it it seems way smaller but um, it does clamp down it does get a good bite and then just like back on the CVT even though we're I mean this is sealed we're on still run a bead of RTV and seal it one more again right through there for reinsurance and then this belt will plug from here or this hose plugs into that adapter that then runs up and falls the rest of the way so we have our exhaust pretty much scuffed in here and ran in here um, and the intake on its way up so that's a key part to know and then I just wanted to mark out that you know in the paying for the kit you're paying for a lot of that thinking to be done already with the angles of where they go and how they're going to lean and the hoses are already cut and all that is it worth the extra money I don't know but I know what protrudes out is going to look very cool so I'm pretty excited about that. The plus side about the hose here is it is a little more heavy duty than the spa hose you get at Lowe's. Uh, most of the hose you get is a pool hose you'll find in the garden section. It's blue. As you see on this one inside, it does have metal rings that run all the way through. It's a little wire that runs all the way from one side to the other. It makes it a little stiffer and it feels a little stronger and more durable than the spa hose, the spa hose that we're used to using from the garden section at Lowe's comes at about 36 foot for I believe about $40 if you do it that way. If, if you built yours with all the PVC pipes and the glue, the RTV, well we still have to buy glue and RTV even after this kit. So if you bought all the homemade stuff, what were you looking at? Um, on average for something like this where you're doing a Polaris where you're running four snorkel tubes, looking at an average about $150 for all the pieces you need, glue, everything. So, the kit might be a little bit more expensive, but you do have all your connections, you're not doing the guesswork, they've already done it already for you. Your hoses are a little stronger, a little better made, and your snorkel risers, when they come out, won't be regular PVC. They actually have the vent lines that can connect to them, where you got to run and zip tie yours to your PVC pipe if you build your own. Yeah, so that's... Like I said, I mean, when he says a little bit more expensive, yeah, like double. But, um, but what protrudes out looks really cool. It's got a little pre-screen in there. Uh, your vent lines run up the back, and they're paintable, so you can customize these and paint them to match your rig. I think uh, the black protruding out of the blue and black bike is going to be um, absolutely on point. So I wouldn't paint them, but I mean, you can you can paint just the tips, you can paint the inserts, you can just paint a stripe down it. You can do all kinds of stuff to really bedazzle these up. Um, and I don't say I don't think that's worth quite double what you could do it stock for. But like Corey said, um, a little better hose, and then like a while I was talking about earlier with having all that pre-planned stuff of 
you know this 45 goes here you know this goes there uh we're able to just uh plug through read the instructions plumb and go plumb and go and make it happen so that's worth some money right there all right shake and bake